Honolulu police tonight still looking for the suspect involved in an alleged sexual assault. It happened on the UH Manoa campus over the weekend. In fact, it happened Saturday night during a Hawaii basketball game at the Stan Sheriff Center. A female reported she was leaving the bathroom when a man in his 30s groped her and then ran off. We wanted to know if the university is making any changes to improve safety after that incident. Elisa Revelo getting answers tonight. Elisa. Howard, a spokesman with the university, tells me safety is their first priority, so they're looking to see what changes can be made. However, they don't have plans to beef up security just yet. I wanted to know what is security like for sporting events at UH. I learned there are two Department of Public Safety officers working during, in, during an event like a basketball game. I also learned there aren't any security cameras inside the Stan Sheriff Center. However, I'm told a full staff includes multiple ushers along with a registered nurse and managers. Do you think two is enough to have at a basketball game? Two security guards? Well, they're not just two security guards. There are 17 ushers. There's a lot of employees. The employees are trained. They're trained to look through the crowd. But right now, we really want to see what the investigation bears out. And uh, we certainly don't want to overreact. I'm told the amount of security and staff is increased depending on the event. UH says this is the first ever reported incident like this in the 23 years that the Stan Sheriff Center has been open. There's no word on the age of the female who was assaulted. As for the suspect, he is described as six feet tall with an average to slim build, light complexion, short wavy hair, and no facial hair. He was wearing dark pants and a blue collar shirt at the time. If you have any information, you're asked to call police. Elisa Arevalo, KHON2 News.